Hello everyone and welcome to Gary's Mod. Today I'll be showing off the Cooper 500. It has a V8 engine. I'm going to run the engine really quick. It sounds very smooth. It has a automatic transmission. You don't have to fiddle with stuff, but it could easily be converted to a manual transmission with a change of the E2 chip. It has decent suspension. I didn't spend too much time with the suspension, but it's just really rigid. It has a bit of damping because it bounces around. This isn't really meant for off-roading, as you can tell. It's meant for on a track, which is why we're at a track. So, let's give it a small spin. Sometimes the engine seizes up. It has brakes in the rear, and it should be front-wheel drive if I configure the E2 properly, but it handles driving phenomenally. Anyways, you can see that this car handles fairly well. I can change the turning radius even more, but I kept it at this because it slides around a lot, as you can see. So here's the engine running without the hood on so that you can see exactly what's happening inside. The brakes use the wire clutch mechanic to freeze up the rear wheels and change the friction of them. Huh. Yeah, this game is broken, if you didn't know that already. So, the wheels are perfect spheres instead of cylinders to prevent the game from breaking more than it already does. And, yeah, it handles most things fairly well. Alright, so here we have the model I used to show this off on the server I built it on. And if we run it, it does do the glitching out thing, and it always does. But eventually it gets going. And you can see that it reaches fairly high RPMs for engines in this game. So, this is the V8 2 and the Cooper 500 2015. So make sure you subscribe and next time we'll be going through some other vehicles that I've made or I might make something entirely new. Who knows? I hope you like this video. Have a good day.